Alright, this video is gonna be on my gay ass fucking neighborhood. The neighborhood that I fucking hate. I can't stand it. I've lived here for fucking 13, 14 years, and it's a fucking mess. It's a bunch of fucking Roman Catholic pagan church members that get paid by the fucking Catholic church just to attend their shitty ass fucking church, and they're all a mob. They think they're the mob. They swear that they're the fucking mob. And the Santeria cults and the fucking Catholic Church decided to join up and team up together. And they think they're the fucking mob. They ain't the fucking mob. Now, yesterday I was smoking a cigarette in my front porch. And I heard cops. Cops were fucking apparently trying to do a noise campaign. And then right afterwards I hear loud ass boom. It was a car accident. Did I give a fuck? No. I went back inside after I smoked the cigarette. I did not go out to instigate. I did not go out to investigate. I did not go out to be a nosy motherfucker. I was minding my own business and I went back inside. Apparently when I wake up this morning and I go to the gay ass 137th Avenue in Coral Way, which I can't fucking stand full of fucking gay ass motherfuckers Chimosos and old people and greedy ass motherfuckers and people that look down on you and all, all these fucking refi Cubans who swear they're the fucking shit. All you fucking piece of shit Cubans that step on one another. I'm tired of y'all. I'm not going to 137 and Coralway ever again. I'm avoiding that fucking area. Apparently, when I when I when I go. I find out that there was a car accident and it knocked down the East Las Canarias Boulevard sign that supposedly said that that, that corner was East Las Canarias uh, property. It was, it was a road designated to East Las Canarias. At the same time, there was another sign. It was the state representative Juan Fernandez Barquin. Both of them got knocked out. Apparently, I also found out that when they put those signs, a lot of high political people and famous people supposedly were there and attended the fucking ceremony when they put up the gay ass motherfucking signs. My opinion on this, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I'm a smart motherfucker. What I'm starting to think is that someone caused the car accident on purpose just to knock those fucking signs out. Someone came up with a clever plan and decided, hey, let's cause a car accident and let's knock down those fucking signs because for some reason it was to their benefit to knock down those motherfucking signs and in a fucking car accident. And at the same time, right before the car accident, there was noise campaigns by police and right after the noise campaigns boom the car accident which I didn't even get to go to I didn't even instigate I didn't even investigate I didn't give a fuck I went back to my house after I smoked my fucking cigarette and that was it now I hate my neighborhood it's full of fucking shitty Roman pagan Catholic members, Belen Jesuits, and I'm tired of them. They think they're the mob? No, you ain't the fucking mob, motherfucker. I've been through hell and back. I got scars, look. I got scars. I got scars. You ain't the motherfucking mob. You think you're the motherfucking mob? You're just a bunch of fucking thieving ass motherfuckers. Stealing from everybody. Every single time everybody goes to your gay ass church. Stealing from people. That's all you motherfuckers do. And then poor me when I'm asking for a fucking dollar. Oh no, I'm the bad guy. While you motherfuckers are robbing people. And doing fucked up things which I'm not gonna even fucking dare to mention. Because it's not worth it. It's not worth my fucking saliva. To mention all the fucked up things you motherfuckers do. From now on, 
I'm avoiding 137 and Coral Way. It's full of gay ass motherfuckers, nosy ass people, gossiping ass people with nothing better to fucking do. And I'm done with coffee. Fuck Cuban coffee, nigga. I'm gonna start representing American coffee to the fullest. American coffee, long live American coffee, nigga. I'm American, baby. I was born in Miami, Florida. Even though I was born in Miami, Florida, that's that's America, motherfucker. Even though Miami, Florida is a melting pot, a Hispanic country, it's still Miami, Florida, America, motherfucker. So I represent America to the fullest. And I'm going to drink my coffee in the morning. And it's going to be American, nigga. Fuck your Cuban coffee. And as for the signs that fell mysteriously after a car accident, that's bullshit, motherfuckers. You're onto something. High political pe people went to that ceremony. High political people went to that ceremony when they put those signs up. Now they're gone. For what reason? I don't know. Do I care? No, I don't give a fuck. Is it a curse to the fucking gay ass Isla Canarias? No, it isn't. Whatever it is, I don't care. You motherfuckers are on some bullshit, bro. The things I see on a daily basis. The fuck shit that goes on in this neighborhood. I've had enough. If I wasn't fucking sick, if my health wasn't fucked up, I'd get the fuck out of here. I want to leave Miami, Florida. I want to enter America. The land of the free. The home of the brave. I don't want to live in Miami anymore. Fucking fucked up neighborhood ran by the fucking Roman Catholic pagan motherfuckers on 142nd and Coral Way. And if you want the name, Mother of Christ. Catholic Church. I'm done with you motherfuckers. You think you're the mob. Oh, you're so gangster. Oh, I'm so fucking gangster. No, you're not a gangster, nigga. Go through what I've been through. F fucking stand the day in my fucking shoes. See if you will survive after all the shit that I've been through, motherfucker. Keep swearing you're the fucking mob. You ain't the mob. And hopefully the South will rise again. The South needs to fucking rise up again. Long live the South. Rise up. It's time for the South to rise up again. The South has been slumbering and sleeping for a long time. It's time to bring back the South. Florida, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Alabama, Mississippi, Texas, and you name it. And every other state that I did not mention. Long live the South. And I'm tired of you bitch ass motherfuckers. Tired of it. Fake ass Christians, fake ass religions, fake ass everything. I'm tired of it, dog. And this house, bro... Bro, this house that I live in, the house that I currently live in, bro, I hate it. Every day it's a fucking argument with my fucking family. Because these motherfuckers are instigating shit. They want me ended up in a loony bin. They want me locked up. They want me to be straight bound to fucking a prison, a jail, or a loony bin. That's what they want. They're dying desperately for me to be stuck in a loony bin. And it's not going to happen, motherfucker. And it's not. When I get better, I'm leaving Miami fucking Florida. Miami fucking Florida is a gay ass country. Long live the South, motherfuckers. Fuck this neighborhood. Fuck this neighborhood. If I could, I would burn this motherfucking house down. I'm so fucking fed up. Torture, abuse, uh, street theater, making the bad guys look like the good guys. 
I'm tired of your fucking shit. You should go to Hollywood. Y'all should become actors. Because you're good at it. Fucking gay ass motherfuckers. And if you think I'm going to shave off my beard. If you think you you know you're dissing me. I got a haircut today. I got a haircut today at 137 in Coral Way. I got a haircut. If you think you're dissing me by leaving half of my beard gone. I'm going to grow that motherfucker out. I'm growing back my beard. The Bible clearly states that a man shall have a beard, and thou shalt not trim the sides of thy beard. So I'm growing back my beard, and whoever doesn't like my motherfucking beard can suck 300 dicks. I rather worship the Most High, follow His commandments, a yeah, shit, yeah, be praised, than fucking fear man. And follow man's traditions. And follow man's fucking gayness. I'm done with this fucking video. Fucking thinking you're the mob. You're the mob. Nigga go to Russia. That's where the real mob is at.